this section, we're going to be looking at internal cab features. We have three good size overhead storage lockers and we have the top bunk. If you're not using it for sleeping, but for storage, you have the addition here of a safety net, which will help reduce any movement of objects whilst you're driving the truck. Solid ladder, making it easy to get on top. And if you're not using the top bunk, you can pull on the handle to put it in its upright position. Underneath the bunk, you have access to the storage lockers and the one here behind the driver's seat is also accessible from outside the vehicle. You have the fridge controls, temperature on and off, and you can access the fridge from this point here. You have a storage drawer, access again to the fridge. You have a bin by the driver's seat and a bottle holder. At the back of the cab, you have additional storage and you can access the switches for the roof hatch, the sun visor, you have a nighttime reading light on and off, and you can also access the night heater from this point. Moving across to the centre console, you have the tray, and underneath this, you have three card slots, which are ideal for licenses or fuel cards. Below this, you have two cup holders, and beneath this, you have two USB points. The one on the left is purely for charging purposes, and the one on the right is to connect your audio device. On the passenger side, in the fuse box, next to the fuses, you will find a SIM card holder. This is ideal for fleet operation or for two-phone connection. 